Hello, welcome to Accounting Hub. I'm Professor George Arpin, PhD in Accounting. And our topic today is Treasury Shares According to the IFRS. So guys, please subscribe our channel. It is very important to us. Like this video, like our Facebook page, Accounting Hub by Dr. Scarpin. So what is Treasury Shares? Are a corporation's own shares that it has reacquired from shareholders, but not retired. Company acquired treasury shares for various reasons to reissue the shares to officers and employees under bonus, enhance the shares market value, to have additional shares available for use in the acquisition of other companies, or to increase the earnings per share. And how do we do that? Let's go to the Excel file. Let's do it together. So, Skype Corporation sells. 10 million of its ordinary shares, 1 euro per share for $10 per share. So this is our regular shares. And the company repurchased 4 million shares at 15 euros per share. So here, we don't care about our value. We don't care about the market value when we sold it first. We work based on the cost. So treasury shares, 4 million times 15, 60 million euros. And credit cash, we are repurchasing it. Case A, we first sell 1 million common shares at $18 per share. If we compare with our cost of 15, we have a gain here. How do we record this gain? Cash, 1 million times 18. Treasury shares at cost, so 1 million, and the cost was 15, 15 million. The number two balance, credit, debit, less credit, share premium, treasury. It's just like the share premium for common shares. It is an equity account. Case B, after that, Cold sold 3 million common shares at 11 euros per share. Now we have a loss. We purchased our cost 15. We are selling 11. We have a problem here. So 3 million times 11. 33 million shares. Credit, treasury shares, the cost. So the cost is 15. So 3 million times 15, 45. And repurchase 4 million, sold 1 million here, 3 million here. We sold the same 4 million. So the numbers must match. So these treasury sh uh, shares here, 60, 15, 45. We are balanced. Our treasury shares is closed. So, okay, we have a loss. How do we record the loss? First of all, we reverse the previous gains. 3 million euros. It is not balanced yet. So, the remaining loss with debit retained earnings. 45 less the sum of our debits. 9. Here, guys, we have no gain or losses at the income statement. We have no net profit or net earnings increase or decreasing here. We are only dealing with equity accounts. And retained earnings, we only decrease it when we have losses. When we have gains, the gain is on share premium. Treasury is just like a share premium for common shares. So, gain, never credit retained earnings. Loss, we reverse previous gains and we debit retained earnings. Never a share premium is a con, a treasury is a contra account. Okay, so it is only a positive number or nothing. 
Okay, guys. So thank you so much for watching this video. Sorry. Thank you so much. Questions or comments, leave it here or email me at jscarping at gmail.com. Have a very nice day and God bless you.